sweet boy. Tonight I went to go stimulate um, Smiles and he's still um, having trouble with the bowel movement. So I had to go kind of um, do a little bit more aggressive wiping him off, you know. He's a baby boy. And then I got a little bit of water on one spot on by the base of his tail and a whole entire swarm of maggots came out so um, I had been seeing these little like um, look like little tiny fleas but I couldn't find any fleas on him and uh, yesterday someone else had like a what looked like a little fly on them we weren't really sure we knew we had checked for ringworm and uh, scabies, things like that. Uh, we weren't sure, so it must have been, um, is that one right there? Oh my gosh. No, it's not. Thank goodness. But anyways, it must have been, um, the maggots were hatching. So we had to get all those off of him just now. So, um, that's milk on him. But, uh, he must have been wherever he was for a while with these open sores on the back of his feet and on his poor little belly and on his paws and everywhere. And because we didn't get him wet or anything until just now for the first time, after taking him in yesterday, I think it was yesterday, um, we did not know there was a ton of maggots on this poor baby. So... I know it seems dumb that you should be able to see that very, very easily, but he's got a pretty thick coat, and uh, like I said, we hadn't gotten him wet yet, so that was awful. I know, buddy. I'm going to feed you a little bit more, huh? He's been a very good eater. His poor little paws. And the upper respiratory, so. Oh my gosh, I just feel even worse now. Oh my lord, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, you're adorable, though. Yes. Oh, smiles. Let's eat some more. <laughs>